Hi, and welcome to this week's Thursday Thoughts. I'm Sarah Hamaker, and I'm glad you joined me. Wait until your father gets home. <clears throat> what role does dad have in your family? Is he regulated to a supporting role, a parenting aid to mom? Does he share in the discipline? Is he merely a buddy, someone to clan around with while mom does the heavy lifting? Part of the confusion today over the role of a father has its roots in the idealized view of the 19, 1950s nuclear family. Dad brought home the bacon, mom fried it up in the pan, and the kids were pretty much seen but not heard. As part of the backlash against what many saw as a cold, distant father figure, dads have moved out of the background and into the foreground, but not exactly into a co-parenting role. Most husbands and wives, when they become mother and father, move into a lopsided arrangement, whereas the wives and mothers become the head of the child-rearing department and the husbands and fathers float into a buddy-pal relationship with the child. If today's typical mother were to tell her kids, wait until your father gets home, and responds to misbehavior, most kids wouldn't worry one iota, one iota. In fact, they would look forward to dad coming home to play with them. This shift in turning dad into a merely play pal hasn't done any favors to the average American marriage either. Most parents forget that they should be spending more time in the role of husband and wife instead of mother and father. Our job is to help our spouse see his or her role is not to be the world's greatest dad or mom, but to be the world great, world's greatest husband or wife. But when we concentrate more on the marriage relationship, you'll actually be a better mother and father. Might sound counterintuitive, but numerous studies have shown that children are happier and feel more secure when they know their parents' marriage is strong. Instead of encouraging your husband or wife to be the world's greatest dad or mom, say you want him or her to be the world's greatest wife or husband. Once you make that change, a more focus on husband and wife than mom and dad roles, moving dad from the fringes of parenting will be, easy, will be easier. A father shouldn't be a mere parenting aid, but a full participant in parenting decisions and discipline. A good rule of thumb is that the parent with the most hands-on interaction with the children should be the primary discipliner. But that doesn't mean dad, in most cases, can't met out consequences when needed and or back mom up by delivering punishments when requested by mom. So what role does dad have in your family's life? I hope that he's right up there as a co-parent and that your children know that he is the husband and the father in the household. I hope you join me next week.